Taking a bite out of crime. A burglar got more than he bargained for in Port Clinton. A dog scared off an intruder trying to burglarize her family's home. 13 ABC's Christine Long reports from Port Clinton with the story all new at 11. Diane, don't mess with Mama. Mama is the dog's name, and police say her teeth may help track down the suspect. Detectives have alerted hospitals to keep an eye out for anyone who comes in with dog bites. DNA evidence still remains in the snow after a dog bit a burglar who entered this family home Sunday night. We did discover a, a medium sized pool of blood just outside the door in a trail of blood leading away from the residence out to the street. Police say thanks to Mama, the intruder didn't get past the front door of this home on the 1200 block of East 3rd Street in Port Clinton. Two young girls were asleep in their beds. 32 year old Tony Bird Jr. was in the bathroom. His girlfriend was working, but he was there with his two with the two kids and the dog. Dog was alerted to something, took off running towards the front of the house. He realized that that wasn't normal behavior for the dog when he came around the corner to the front door, uh, saw a subject trying to get out the front door and the dog was going after them. Detective Carpenter says Mama is a service dog trained to help Bird's daughter cope with several conditions. I can say when we came in, the dog was very friendly to us, allowed us to pet her. Uh, so she seems pretty even temperamented. I've got a dog myself, had a dog all my life, and I'd hope if somebody broke in, my dog would, would react the same way. Police don't know yet the make or model of the getaway vehicle. It's described as a dark color with tail lights that run across the entire back width, similar to a Dodge Charger. Reporting in Port Clinton, Christine Long, 13 ABC Action News.